What is going on, beautiful people? Happy days. We are actually on our way up to the bong. We have... We all know that. Justice. We have Freddy. And we have Amy. So, let us leave. I never actually used this while I was in America. How foolish. But now it's time to put it on. And thanks to this quick release mount, it is easier than ever. All good, bro. Yo, make the video sound more better. English is gooder. Look who's here. We got Crystal here. And look, Arnold. Seven. Ooh. Seven. Such a blessing. Ooh. Such a beautiful day. All right, let's let us leave. Look, it's Michelle. Hello. Mm -mm. Dab on him, D. Dab on him. Mm. Is this your big one? Yeah, it is. You're meeting someone famous? We'll yep. stop. Oh, the man himself. The man him. Look how freshly shaved this boy is. Ooh, my top lip, boy. <laughs> have the Duca himself, Damien. What a family. It's your boy, Deezy. Go check out his Instagram. I'll probably link it right around here somewhere. <laughs> so, church just finished and now we are on our way to Ingle Splinters yep, at Bonnell's Bay. So, uh, shout out to Framey Films. Go check it out. F-R-A-M-Y-F-I-L-M-S. Framey Films. The man, the myth. Again, we run into. What up, what up, what up? We run into Bizzle. We have here with us Eric DeMessa himself. How long has it been since I've seen you last, Eric? Four weeks. I think I'd like to highlight that um, Hannah and I, today is not the first day that we, um, we're making our decision. We made our decisions when we first started Bible study, you know what I'm saying? When we first reached out to Jesus in a church where, you know, surrounded by family and friends that genuinely love me, I'd rather be, you know, out there putting my body on the line. Again, if you are Christ, then you are Abraham's seed and heirs according to the promise. And if I was to be real with Jai and, and Henry, I'll tell you now, there are a lot of battles ahead. Rome, we don't count the rips that you do easily. We count the rips that you struggle with because it's the rips that you struggle with that grows you physically and mentally. Mm. I pause and I look back on my journey, I realize that there are some situations that God allows you to go through and as you struggle through those situations, you don't only grow spiritually, but it hardens you up. It hardens you up to a point where you, you realize that God is a God that would not allow you to go through something unless he knows you can handle it. He's not going to allow you to go through something unless he knows you can handle it. But the best thing about it is the fact that he goes through it with you. What you go through, what, the, what people in the world go through, you'll go through yourself. Just because you're a Christian does not make you immune to the realities of life. You go through it all together. The difference though is you cling on to hope. Those who believe are clinging to hope because they know that they're not in this alone. Is this 1 Corinthians chapter 10 verse 13. I don't know if you've heard this text before, but I love it. Every single time I go through something, I read that text. And it says, no temptation, regardless of its source. Jai, I heard you up here say, you know, when I go through the difficulties, you know, lift us up, don't laugh at us. They bring us down. No temptation, brother, regardless of its source, has overtaken or enticed you that is not common to human experience. 
nor is any temptation unusual or beyond human resistance, but God is faithful. God is faithful. I love how the text centers right on God. God is faithful to his word. He is compassionate and trustworthy, and he will not let you be tempted beyond your ability to resist. But along with the temptation he has in the past and as in now and will always, I'll say that again, always, provide the way out as well so that you will be able to endure it without yielding and without and will overcome temptation. 2,000 years ago, Jesus came to rescue us and to set us free, to transform us and to renew us. And today, both Jai and Henry are giving their lives to Jesus today. Jai, I, Romulia, and Pastor Wayne French, baptize you in the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Ghost.